after three weeks of intense studying with her dad, Emily almost got a perfect ACT score of 35. How to cheat on the ACT? Holy shit, should I say it? Okay, so in high school, I was... My my dad cared so much about me, uh, about me like getting good grades and whatnot, and like getting a good ACT score, or whatever. My dad would make me take like practice ACT tests every like almost every week. And then one of these tests, it was like an at home test, like a practice test, and I did the English section, and then I cheated. Okay, so then I would look at the look at the back of the book and like look at the uh, the answer keys, and then go back and like fill it in, <laughs> be like, okay, I'm gonna put the answer here so then my dad won't get mad at me i finished the test and then i gave it to my dad and my dad's like oh, emily congrats you got a 35 on your english you're so smart and i'm like thanks dad thank you yeah i i got a 35 and he's like great job emily and i'm like thank you so much and i was just like nervous that he would get mad at me if i got like a bad score which is why i would cheat the next test came along and i'm like doing the test and then I like look to the back of the answers again and he comes down the stairs and sees me looking at the back of the back of the, the test and he's like, Emily, what are you doing? And I'm like, oh my God, he caught me. He was so, so mad at me, okay? He was so, so mad at me that he literally ripped out all the answers and then he dropped it off at the neighbor's house. And he's like, if you're gonna want the answers, you have to go all with the neighbor's house and ask them for the answers. And he didn't even have them. He like, he ripped it out and then put it at the neighbor's. And then I'm like, okay. And so then, after that, I couldn't even look at the answers anymore, and he was so mad at me. So, yeah, that was uh, that was pretty bad. And oh my god, like my heart was racing. He was so angry.